It's the first day of summer, and the city's new zoo is celebrating its grand opening. As the zoo's senior rehydration engineer, it's your job to hand out bottles of completely normal, very not magical water. But something goes terribly wrong. Momentarily distracted by all the super hot guys, you accidentally hand out the zoo's entire supply of magically cursed water. Suddenly, there are flashes of light and puffs of smoke. All around, there are sounds of attractive men being transformed into animals. Oh, the humanity. Each of the newly transformed animals races off in a flurry of chaos, leaving only a single solitary bunny behind. Um, beg your pardon, the bunny says. I appear to have been transformed into a hare of some kind. Could I get a refund on my admission if it's not too much trouble? His little nose twitches a bit, and as you stare into his beautiful brown eyes, you are filled with sudden, powerful determination to get him that refund. And also find a way to break that curse. But how were you to accomplish such a thing? As though on cue, you suddenly hear a voice from the heavens. Oh, hi. Oi, you there, says the magical spirit animal in the sky. Look at you, stuck in the middle of a weird animal plot line. Good for you. My name's Mine. Cube. Okay, and I'm gonna help you out. Because only an act of true love is gonna break those curses. And you look like you could use a crash course. <laughs> yeah. Put on your dancing shoes, check your breath, and follow me. It's time to play some Blush Blush. Let's get started. Just tap in the guy's tab and then Nim's cute little face to see how he's doing. Okay, so we're playing Blush Blush, if you can tell. I'm already... Very intrigued on how this game is going. Guys. Nim, I think that's how you pronounce it. Remember. Each guy you unlock will have different desires you need to fulfill in order to grow their love for you. Remember, only love can break the curse. Hmm. Looks like Nim just wants a refund for his zoo admission. Sounds reasonable for that. You're gonna need a job. Tap on the jobs tab. Okay, jobs. Oh. Most of them are locked right now. I guess you're not qualified yet. Uh-huh. Each job takes time blocks to do, and you only have a few to spare. But don't worry, once you turn them off, you get your time blocks back. Alrighty. Tap on the SoPro job to start your exciting career. Okay. What, do we just do it? Great. Great, you'll be able to afford that refund in no time. <laughs> and here's one more hot tip for jobs. If you keep a job active for long enough, you'll earn promotions, which means more money in your pocket. Being employed rules. Mm. Let's get, let's go back to Nim. Okay. okay. <laughs> it's cute. Now we've got money flowing in. I'll teach you about hearts. It's super easy. Every relationship level you reach will need hearts, and they're super easy to earn. You can get hearts by chatting, giving gifts, dating, and even by just tapping on the guy a whole bunch. <laughs> Try it. Chat with Nim with the talk button and then give him a bunch of tappy taps. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about this game, honestly. Nim, so I've been turned into a rabbit. That's new? Yes, new is definitely the word for it. Okay, so just tap on him and you get hearts. Well, I'm not sure this is working. I understand if you'd rather shake hands and part ways now. Seems like a lot of trouble. Oh. oh, you'll keep trying? Great, thanks for sticking with it. I am one appreciated bunny. Okay. Okay. Okay, for his next level, Nim is hoping for you to level up your smart tat. Stat. And take him to dinner. It's time to learn about hobbies. I had a dream last night that I turned back into a human. But then I got ready for the day and went to work before I woke up, so that's 3 out of 10. Would not recommend... Okay, let's stop tapping on him so much. I lied. Now let's stop tapping. All right, hobbies. Each hobby you work on improves one of your stats. They each take three time blocks to do. So once again, you need to use your time wisely. Fortunately, you've got enough to do some reading, which will make you smart. Activate your reading hobby. While you're working on that, make sure you have some free time blocks and we'll take Nim on a date. You can tell how many time blocks you have, and how many are in use, at the top of the screen here. <laughs> They're color-coded for your convenience. Green means jobs, orange means hobbies, and pink means dates. 
All right, let's read. Oh, this one's a lot slower than the uh, than the jobs. Luckily, I'm okay with reading. Reading's pretty fun. Let's go tap on Bunny some more. That Bunny sounds awfully femboyish in a way. He said the same thing though. I will keep tapping. Luckily, I'm a spam expert. Geometry Dash got me this way. All right, done tapping on him. Hobbies. I think it went by one time and it went to like 30 seconds or some shit. I don't know. I guess we just wait. So I'm a little disappointed. <laughs> it went by two times and it went from 30 seconds to 50 seconds. That's kind of ass. I'm gonna go tap on the bunny some more. Yeah, keep repeating the same things. Actually, we we, we haven't talked to him yet. Uh, um... Honestly, the worst part of all this is my nose keeps twitching. Granted, it's mega cute, but it makes me feel suspicious. Okay. Nice. Uh, gotta wait a few. Like five seconds. Before I can talk to him again. Talk. Um. So, to turn me back to normal, you just need to hang out with me. That's cool, I guess. Maybe you could start some sort of curse-based dating service. That's, uh, a way to put it. Spam! Uh. Ah, no, no, no. No tickling the bunny. I know it's hard, but resist the temptation. Okay, fuck you then. Alright, how much money do we have? We have 1,000. I'm rich, bitch. Let's take him to dinner, I guess. Why not? Are you sure he wants to go on dinner with Nim? Uh. Oh, shit. We need three extra time blocks. Okay. Confirm diamond purchase. I believe we- do we have any diamonds? Yeah, we have one. Okay, well, he's eating a carrot. He looks awfully comfortable. I hope he- it, that carrot's delicious. You know? Click to complete. Um... Still no luck, hey? Do we have to do anything else to break the curse? Do we need, I don't know, a magical sword or a quest or something? Hmm. Honestly, seeing how this game is so far, I wouldn't doubt it. Well, I'm glad for that much at least, I've never been on a quest, but I have a sneaky suspicion I wouldn't be particularly good at them. I earned a diamond, cool. While walking through the park, you catch Nim giggling to himself. Sorry, I was just thinking how much easier it is making friends as a rabbit, and caught myself wondering why I hadn't tried this sooner, ha ha ha. Hmm? Okay. I dug up my own garden yesterday and built a den. A warren? Whatever rabbits build, I might get desperate and set a trap for myself. This game is very interesting. It really is. Oh, now we can work on survival. We need three extra time blocks. I'm broke, I don't have fucking diamonds for that, and I'm not spending money on this game. Um... Well, we can keep talking to him, but... I feel like it won't change much. Oh, right now we're at, like, frenemy, really? Well, do we start off as enemies or something? I'm sorry that I made a mistake and turned you into a rabbit, you fucker. I can give gifts, I didn't know that. Uh, I don't think we can give- oh, we can, hold on. Well, maybe, I don't know for sure. Uh, we don't have any carrots, that's ass. Closest thing I see to carrot is a veggie tray, and that has carrots right here, so... How about that? Uh, I'll pay. <laughs> How did you know exactly what I had a craving for? It's like you could see into my mind and read from a list of requirements I had. Spooky. Oh god. <laughs> um. <laughs> Owie, I just stepped on my ear, which is a really funny sentence. Ha ha ha. I kind of like this game, but in a way I'm slightly unnerved by it. I don't know why, but it's kind of nice. It's cute. I am almost there. Uh. There we go. Aha, uh -huh, no tickling the bunny, blah, blah, blah. I know. Well, I can't tickle him anymore. I don't think he wants to be tickled. Uh, um. <laughs> I'm guessing that's all he's gonna say anymore is that he stepped on his fucking ear. Let's give him another gift. Um, how about a comb? <laughs> so he wanted a comb. Okay. Interesting. All right, stats, my avatar items. Oh, we can pick uh, hairstyles and shit. This one's probably the most like mine so far. Just make it a little bit longer. Actually, no, this is. Just it has more bangs and this and that, whatever. I could use kitty ears, I could have a cap. 
Glasses. A tail. Nice. Tails are cool. All right, what do we got for achievements? Uh, pulled out of a hat. Reach friend zone with Nim. We get a diamond for that. I know you dug up your own garden. You said it like a thousand fucking times at this point, my guy. I have a 24-7 carrot craving, which is loads better than the sugar craving I had before. Hey, I guess technically I've lost like 120 pounds on this rabbit diet. Okay, that's not funny. That was just a little cringy if I'm being honest. I don't know if he said that as a joke, but I'm hoping he was serious. I could take him on a boat ride. Nope. I don't have fucking diamonds. Okay, uh... Level 2, it says Guts. So we got the the requirement. Which is fine, but how do we get this? How do we do this? I, I don't fucking know. What do we get, a soccer ball or some shit? 33 million for a fucking baseball. This game's a rip-off. Alright, let's read his information. The name is Nim, he's 20 years of age. His hobby is reading. His favorite job is a baker. His gift preference is ice cream. Liked trait is smart. Birthday is July 4th. Blood type is O positive. Favorite food is oatmeal cookies. Occupation is PA and his height is 5 foot 6. He's shorter than me in IRL. But knowing that he likes ice cream, maybe I might be able to get him some ice cream if he could buy any. Yeah, we can't get him ice cream. Sucks to suck, but whatever. His favorite food is oatmeal cookies. I don't think we can buy those. And if we could, we couldn't fucking afford it. Oh, in order to actually do shit, we have to pause things. That's ass. Pause that. Let me fucking stop. All right, maybe I can take him on a date now. Let's go on a boat ride. Nope, apparently we can't do that right now neither. Stop you for a minute. Can we do it now? Please? Okay, we did it. You can take him on a boat ride. Also, where's my hat and everything? I, I don't have it on for some reason, and I equipped it at fucking asshole game. Well, we got like five seconds to wait until the boat ride's over. Uh, click to complete. Uh, uh. Wow, I've never had a duckling swing up to me because I it thought I looked cute. Maybe being a rabbit isn't so bad after all. Well, of course not. Rabbits are cute little animals. I can do the survival, though, which is nice. Because I need to up my survival. Not <laughs> Even though I don't know what the fuck it's going to do. I also just looked at the top and realized I'm getting achievements. Stitch, uh, stitch Kitch, So Show, and What's Up Doc. That better not be a Bugs Bunny reference. Yay, more time unlocked. I also unlocked Volks. And achievement unlocked, Lone Wolf. I was about to say, why did I have tits? I'm a male. <laughs> hmm? Oh, I unlocked Volks. Okay, I didn't know that. One day while out in the forest practicing your survival training, you're attacked out of nowhere by a sharply dressed bear. But before she can land a super sick burn, a wolf suddenly intervenes. After a ferocious battle, the wolf drives the bear away and looks at you with intense, brooding eyes as he licks his wounds, he scoffs. Wounds. Oh, it's you. Well, don't get too excited. The bear and I just had some unfinished business. Why are you looking at me like that, with that weird gleam in your eye? Don't tell me you're gonna keep bothering me. Fuck my life. Hey. Okay, so we got an asshole. So I'm a wolf. All my boyhood dreams have come true. Too bad I was such a dumbass little kid. He's an asshole, but at least he's honest. I gotta wait three seconds for my survival to stop, and I'm gonna pause it again. Pause. Achievement unlocked. Beyond karaoke night. Interesting. Oh, we can get another job. Musician. Karaoke jockey. Okay. Cool. So, I read that already. What are your stats, dude? His name is Volks. He's 22 years of age. His hobby is survival. His favorite job is writer. His gift preference is socks, as expected, knowing you're mostly dog. Uh, his light trait is guts. His birthday is February 17th. His blood type is A negative. His favorite food is meat, clearly. His occupation is model, and his height is 5'7. Also shorter than me in IRL. This quest to change me back better not involve the power of friendship or the power being in me all along. 
or any of that crap. So we're in adversary right now. I I will spam to my heart's content. All right, no more spamming. That's getting boring. Uh, let me. Oh wait, you can't gift him anything. Maybe I could take him for dinner. I don't know. Okay. He looks like he's disgusted at a bowl of salad. Very nice. Uh, go on, or gone on one, two. Click to complete. Ugh. That was terrible. The salad wasn't even the worst part. It was that waiter that kept asking me why I wasn't hungry like the wolf. I'm glad I bit him. Uh, okay, me and him should get along fine. Let me go check on Nim. Hmm? I know, you dug up your own garden. You've said it a million- Oh, he needs seeds. We can buy those. Uh, pay. Hmm? I've literally never spent so much time with someone else before, so are we gonna keep trying tomorrow? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Great, I mean, I, I don't want to tackle this alone, and I'm sure you're busy, so this works for me. <sighs> You've reached the next stage with Nim. You've earned a diamond. Thanks. Now we're in the friend zone. Oh, this fucker friend zoned me. My word, the world is not built for rabbits. Have you ever tried opening a pudding cup with paws? I want pudding so bad. Let me guess I got an open pudding for you then? I wouldn't get any closer if I were you. I'm not saying I'll bite you, but I'm not saying it either. Okay. I'll take his word. Spam! There we go. I hate everything about this. Dude, you literally look like the kind of person who hates literally everything. Oh, we gotta take him on a dinner date again. Okay. Yeah, he still looks disgusted at that salad. Click to complete. Uh... I didn't ask for your help, but if you want to waste your time bothering me, I guess I can't stop you. Does this mean I'm stuck with you for now? Probably. Mm. Well, at least being turned into a wolf isn't the worst part of all this anymore. Mm. Oh, you're an asshole. If you see that bear again, just ask her what she did with all the puppies. Her last lover bought her. The awkwardness will drive her off. I don't think I want to know anymore. So we got to get him to 3,533 hearts. Going back to spam. There was a tortoise downtown talking smack about me. He said some nasty things, threw dirt at me, and then challenged me to a race. So I got the police involved. <laughs> okay, that's kind of funny. That's kind of funny. Um, oh, level four healthy. Well, we can get one thing out of the way. Let's take, let's give him a veggie tray again. <laughs> well, you're welcome, my guy. I hope you're happy with it. She sure like them veggie bowls, don't you? I don't know if we'll be able to take him on a coaster ride yet, but we'll try. We need two extra time blocks. Very nice, very nice. I'm gonna stop this for now. Let's take you on a, stop talking. I'm taking you on a coaster ride. There we go. He looks kind of terrified. It's so sad, yet kind of cute. And then, yet, yeah, there I am, still fucking naked. No, no hair, no hat, no tail or anything, but naked. Uh, uh... Oh my, I, um, I will maybe sit out the next ride. I mean, I'm sure there's probably a rule about rabbits and roller coasters that we're unaware of. Better safe than sorry. Yeah, I guess that's accurate. I need to turn my job back on so I get fucking money. Uh... I'm gonna... Stop talking about pudding. Let's get this guy to 3,533 hearts. Huh? Well, uh, oh, I didn't read it. I'm a fucking cunt. Check on Volks. We gotta get him the 5,543 hearts. Oh my god, I gotta spam with this fucker? Really? I can take you for a boat? All these fucking... Oh my god. Oh, this is the healthy thing. I gotta get the level four healthy for, um, fucking Nim. I will pause. Hopefully I have enough to do the boat. Hopefully. There we go. I don't think he likes his tail being wet. Yeah, I look exactly the same, but he looks completely unentertained. Here's a tip. Swum boats aren't made for wolves. Real shocker, I know. Also, wet wolves smell a lot like wet dogs, so now we've got that to enjoy. I mean, you're kind of a wet dog. 
I believe wolves are more on the dog side of the family thing. I think you'll save time if you just ask who's not afraid of the big bad wolf, because so far, the alternative is a bloody long list. Let's take him on in one more of this. Therefore, we can get that mission out of the way. Click to complete. All right, well, there we go. Two out of two, boat ride. So we need to get the level four guts, level three healthy, which we just got there. We literally just got there. And we need to get 5,543 hearts. I need to start a job again. I'm not getting paid. My sense of smell is a billion times stronger in a world where showering is optional. We. Oui. I'm gonna be honest, spamming this fucking long is really annoying. And I'm really not enjoying it. So we need to get the level 4 healthy. We're literally almost there. Almost. Two. One. Zero. Goody goody. I don't need that anymore. Let's turn that off for now. We got a chicken. What the fuck? That is a fat cock. Well, it's going to be easier to get him to level or get him to 3,533 hearts compared to fucking bolts. Ugh, yuck. I ate a bowl of trick cereal I felt like I couldn't resist. Anyway, they're definitely not a part of a rabbit's breakfast. I am very ill. Well, duh. Oh my god. Yes! Wait, did you say that in order to break the curse, you want to try a kiss? Oh no. Yeah. Oh well, I'm um, sure. I mean, it's for medicinal purposes, right? I guess we can give it a try. You reached the next stage with Nim. You earned one diamond. Diamond! So we have to kiss? Well, okay. I mean, it's for medicinal purposes, right? You lean in for a smooch and there's a sudden shower of sparkles and bubbles, transforming the rabbit into mostly not a rabbit. Progress. Hmm? <laughs> well, he's not 100% a rabbit anymore. I keep looking down and realizing I'm mostly human again. Now that is definitely unique. Relief to experience. Okay, well. I'll definitely make more videos on the future, and eh, I'll make more videos on this game in the future, but as of right now, I'm kind of done. I don't want to play for too long. I don't want to make myself bored, because I have been enjoying this, being an idiot. So, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. If you want to buy it, it's actually free. The game's free. If you want to download the game, it will be linked in the description. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.